All right, this is Birch Burke Johnny here again. Just uh, up here in another location, doing just overlooking the what's called the Hungry Horse Reservoir. It's gorgeous over there. It's starting to rain pretty good right now. I'm surprised it's not snowing at this altitude. I'm really surprised it hasn't snowed yet this year. More than it has, actually. As you can see on those hills up there, it snowed a little bit. But, uh... I'm just sitting here uh, with my friend and we were talking and we were just... Uh, just, we're both very grateful. We were talking about what a blessing it is to be able to come out here and do this and to enjoy, uh, you know, God's creation. And, uh... I'll just... We were talking about how thankful we are that um, men had it in their hearts to make this country a free nation. Now, um, I, it's gone; it's come a long ways from its beginnings, and it's not what it used to be. But um, there's not a lot of places on this earth that we can go and do still to this day what we're doing right now sitting up here uh, enjoying this gorgeous view uh, looking for an elk to harvest and to put in the truck and to take home and to feed ourselves with um, and you know there's still there's a lot of places in America you, sh you can't do that anymore and so we're just really tremendously grateful for what uh, what we have and we thank God for that and I don't care whether you believe in God or not. I mean, I can't look at these mountains and this beauty and it, and say that this is an accident. And, uh, I mean, that's just ridiculous to me. To me, it takes more faith to believe that uh, there is no God. But uh, I just wanted to show you guys this this gorgeous view up here. Uh, another thing I wanted, I've been wanting to do this for a while. I've been uh, wanting to do a little shout out and just to show some support uh, to someone who has encouraged me and who has been, uh, who has supported me and actually uh, gave me a shout out a while back. And I'm just really grateful. Um, and I just want to uh, give a shout out to Destructo. Uh, I think his channel is. Uh, uh, L Marshall 32. I'll put a link in the description. But uh, Marshall, he's been awesome, man. He, I've been watching his videos and watching uh, how he interacts with other YouTubers, and he's very respectful. He doesn't um, do negative feedback, and uh, he just—he's a great guy. He's an encouraging person, and he's been an encouragement to me. And uh, um. Brother, I'm a, I'm appreciative of you, and and uh, guys like you are part of the reason why I'm still here on YouTube. Uh, because there's a sense of community out there, and I've been wanting to do a, a video response and and a support for the crew, um, but I haven't had time to get to get around. I've been really busy uh, doing this right here enjoying God's creation and that's very important to me and um, and uh, I just have not you know between work and all the other stuff that I do I haven't had time to make videos and do the video responses and stuff and but uh, I just wanted to support Destructo because he's an awesome human being uh, at least from what I've seen I've never seen anything that would make me think that he's not good people and uh, just say keep it up brother uh, you're one of the most supportive people I've ran into out there um, so this has just been this has been a long time coming I've been wanting to do this just a quick shout out to him uh, if you guys aren't sub to destructo check him out if you like him subscribe Give him some comments, some thumbs up. Uh, I know he'd appreciate it. Uh, that's something else, you know. It's like he's one of those guys that 
he responds to comments and and uh you know not that i mean you can't expect that from everybody there's some people out there that have so many subscribers and stuff and i don't i certainly don't expect that from people that you know have hundreds of subscribers and stuff but uh i know he does what he can to uh get back to people and uh, so i just want to support people like that and i know there's others out there and and anytime i see somebody who's doing doing good and doing right uh, i'm gonna i'm gonna support them so anyhow this is birch bark johnny uh, uh, i'm also gonna attach a couple other hunting clips to this video one of the clips i'm gonna attach is a sign where we were hunting yesterday if you see those mountains on the other side of those mountains right there um that's those mountains are what comprises Marias Pass. On the other side of those mountains is Glacier National Park. Uh, there's a on the other side of the, the river that's on the other side of those mountains is Glacier Park. I was hunting up in that country yesterday. And there was a trail that was closed up there because a grizzly bear had munched some guy up there uh, a few days ago. So apparently, and the, one of the his fellow hunters had to shoot it off of him, uh, but it had a couple other bears with it a couple of um big cubs they're probably two-year-old cubs and they're <laughs> uh they're pretty formidable that size of a cub but anyways so they so they had the trail closed up there so i just took a quick clip video of the sign i'll probably have to loop it so you can have enough time to read it um, but i just thought that was kind of interesting but anyways uh this is birch bark johnny signing out you guys have a a great day. Here we are up on uh, the reservoir doing some hunting. Looking down into a clear cut. Just starting to rain a little bit. Reservoir's just pretty calm. You can see it's, I don't know if you can see, but I can see that it's raining down there. Back in the background, those hills back there, that's the edge of the, I think that's called the Great Bear Wilderness. Beyond those, you'll probably see down here, that big white snowy mountain back there, that's called Great Northern. It's a beast. I just wanted to get a clip of this in here. It's a pretty sweet view. I think I just heard a rifle shot. So. Just sitting up here hoping we can catch something moving. Catch something moving through here, maybe we can get a crack at it. 